Hello, welcome Plushy Knight, welcome Alfie Stream, uh, first time chatters, good to see you. Um, uh, I'm here, uh, Light is here. Uh, Howdy. Fantastic person who pointed me at this game. Um, and, and then I spent an unreasonable amount of time getting it running. Um, I am so impressed. This game is nearly as old as I am. Um, that's hard in it's computer older terms, than is my me. understanding, to make that work. It was, it was, it was a pain. Hey, Sikari. Hey, Mouse Witch. It took, it took. I, I worked on getting it running for 10 hours and then I was like, I'm tired. Jesus. And I went to bed and I woke up and I did another five hours and I got it working. <laughs> Holy crap. Christ. Uh, I'm I'm in awe. Yeah, I hope this um, isn't a garbage game. I don't think it is. I've never it, played it. It looks I've... interesting. It looks interesting. It looks interesting. <laughs> um. Imagine spending fifteen plus hours on something. I would never. Yeah. <laughs> no, I just I just I, I hyper focused or whatever. I don't know. It was fun. Um. I I yeah. wrote I wrote up like everything I did and tried in order um so like I, I have a record of what I did and some of my thought process uh and and I can clean that up and make that public if people are interested I've already told Light that I'll send it her way I think that sounds kind of fun yeah yeah uh -huh. I'll filter something out of that hey at least now you'll be prepared to play many other interesting brand for elephant games from 1995 <laughs> i can run i think anything that was on windows 3.1 wow um i'm only saying this because i'm not going to do it but i considered very seriously um making coda be on stream with me for like the, the edutainment sonic game which looked not good uh and i was gonna oh, be like this is a hostage situation <laughs> like a sonic the hedgehog game yeah sonic schoolhouse seep says wow you can run both of the games for windows 3. <laughs> i was actually i was actually looking through um windows 3.1 games and unless the internet lied to me uh, Putt Putt, Freddy Fish, and Muppet Treasure Island should all run on this, which is great because those are the games I had as a kid and never finished. Um, so I, I might, I might do those at some point. I don't know if I'll stream them or just play them, but I am eyes emoji because I always really wanted to finish Muppet Treasure Island. I never saw the movie, but I played like the beginning of the game a, a lot. Okay, so Muppet Treasure Island is one of my favorite movies of all time. Hey, maybe we should watch that together sometime. We hey, should. I don't think I knew that they made a game of it. There's a game. Well, well, now we have to play the game. We'll, we'll, we'll schedule playing that at some point. Anyway, here is the game. This is as as big as I can get it. I think. They did make Tim Curry look like a human for it. It's true. Tim Curry <laughs> the movie. Like a human. Um. No, I've I've literally never seen the movie. It's good. They have some good numbers. But uh Yeah. Anyways, yeah. Museum of Anything Goes. Museum of Anything Goes. Um the audio sh should be working for y'all. I am not one hundred percent sure. Anyway, here's the introduction. Uh, let, let me know if you guys can hear this. You should be hearing it. I, I, I do think this intro is really adorable. It's very charming. This is pretty good. Yeah, sound works. Getting the sound to work was actually the big challenge. Uh, that in color. I actually got the game to run in about three hours. Uh, and then it took 12 hours to figure out the color and the sound. You can turn right, you can turn left, you can step forward, 
step backwards, move at an angle, or you can just click on. I I I love the fucking audio what? quality. It's bad. Also, hi, so lucky you. I'm glad I'm glad that everyone is here for the fruits of my torment. Um, there's there's this little um. Menu thing here. Uh, I don't remember how to get out of it. Oh, there we go. Um, I I gather that you can like walk. Or, there's oh, there's stuff. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's guests here, which is nice because you you sort of expect this like not to be populated. Uh, uh it. But no, there's human people here. It doesn't want to let me click on them, so. Uh, I, I, I guess that guy was a dive get, bomber. I think we just woke up into this as in a dream. Yeah. In the, the lore of the game. It's hard to say. Like, that looks like the ocean. Okay. I mean, what I've heard is that this game is kind of like a fever dream. Um, so I'm just accepting it. Awesome. Um, Amazing. like, I saw, I saw some of the reviews and stuff when I was looking for stuff to get it running. Mm -hmm. Uh, there we go. Oh, hello. God, I love full motion video. I think that more horror games should be full motion video. Um, because I think that that's really uncanny valley in a way that's good for horror games. Yeah, I think you're right. Uh, I think these guys are just gonna keep going forever. Yeah. Just blocking off that way around the museum. Oh. Yeah. Uh, and, and now we have the museum. Uh, Mouse says that she should send me her command prompt horse racing game. I am interested in this. Oh, that's amazing. That's a, okay, yeah, yeah, like a learning to program kind of game. That's good. Seeb says, so for a period of time in the 90s, if you wanted to do a rave, you had to have a cover story. So you would rent a warehouse and tell them you were filming for a multimedia production because they would have zero expectations as to what m might be involved in this and would not care. That tracks. I don't amazing. know if this is true, but I'll incorporate that into my belief system. Uh, and also, hello, Incomprehensible. I, th I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, welcome to the chat. Um, right, so onto the museum, y'all. Right oh what my god. Happened to me? Oh, Jesus. Don't go in there. Look what happened to me. What? I'm, I'm sorry. What were you saying before the skeleton interrupted? I don't remember. Uh, should we cancel the stream? Is this a problem? We <laughs> this is Gary Boatman there. I think I'm feeling brave, but I'm I'm also feeling brave. Mouse says one of the horses has a built-in handicap that if it's about to win, it keels over and dies in second place. <laughs> and Sikari says sleep warns you to stay away from the museum. That sounds like something he would do. <laughs> see, see, sleep is always like don't go into this location. Classic sea sleep behavior. Look what happens to me is a good Okay, that that exactly. child is like that's the child from The Shining. I mean, that's not actually the child from The Shining, but that's like that's that, that's evocative. That's very evocative. When did The Shining come out? When did The Shining come out? Was it before or after this? I think before. I'll look it up. Hang on. 1980. Yeah. Okay. That's... Okay. So. You're gonna stand there all day. Yes, I am gonna stand here all day. Also, hype train! Thank you, everybody. Yo. Okay, I think I think. Oh, yes. okay, okay. There's a map. Okay, I like uh, the question mark areas. I think that's fun. That is fun. Um, I am not at all sure. Did we just move? Oh, hello? <laughs> hello? the first room. Try going forward? No, fuck if I know what's going on. If I had to guess when you- Oh, Jesus. Look 
Uh, hi, August. That's We're. I think. I think this game was not intended to be a horror game. Um, okay, so I tried to do a little research on this and it mostly failed. Um, but I will read from the back of the game. Here are like the five things this game has to offer. Okay. Um, in, in broad terms. Um, one, photorealistic 3D space. Nailed it. I think we can yeah. all agree. Two, travel. Three, yeah. interactive. Yes. Four, discover. And five, nightmare visions. Okay, so maybe it was meant to be a horror game. I think it's meant to be a horror game. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> Seep says, because this is just normal for natural history museums, really. Um, <laughs> fair warning, I think something something horrible happens to a pig at some point. I saw a review that was like, I wish I had been warned about this, so I feel like I've got to warn about it, even though I'm not like really sure when or where it is. Um, I saw another video to have, like, I think I will be able to tell before it happens. Okay, uh, I know cool, the main thing cool, is cool, that cool. there's, like, a picture of a pig being butchered in a context where you're like, is that a human person? And, like, no, it is a pig, but, like, okay. it's a spooky context, and also it is, like, a dead pig. So, yeah, I think I'll be able to tell if we're, like, near that, but uh, not 100% certain since God knows what's going on here. This is definitely a game of all time. Okay, let's check out this picture. Can I not? Yeah. Hello? Can we not, can we not go close to the art? <laughs> There we go. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, this immersion is something. Oh, okay. Oh. I spent a year of my life tutoring sixth graders at Gray Elementary School in Chicago. It was quite a rewarding experience. Most Ooh. of the children were a joy to work with. Some of them could really challenge you. With a sense of humor, and by treating them as equals, I managed to survive. The Chicago public school system was generally regarded as one of the worst in the country. There was one Mac LC2 computer with 37 students in this classroom. Do you think that's going to prepare them for the next century? There's obviously a lack of resources and a lack of funding in the Chicago public school system. You can throw around all the numbers that you want, but to me these children are real people whose futures I actually care about. Click interviews if you want to meet some of them. Okay. Wow. Use morphs. Uh, Did you click on morphs. Yeah, one sec. Sikari says, "Can you imagine how, how? Can you imagine how freaky it would be if you recognize yourself in one of the photos?" Uh, I think that's also the plot of The Shining. Um, and August says, "Shout out to a tardigrade exhibit in Spain that was basically like videos of writhing bodies and wild interpretive dance. Great time. Felt like I was on drugs ten of, out of ten. Uh, that sounds like a fantastic experience. I love tardigrades. That sounds great. Wait, are right. bodies of tardigrades or, or like people acting like tardigrades? Because I think both are good. I can yeah, see both are good. Different. Okay, morphs. Oh, oh. Huh. oh they're morphing. Oh, they sure are. I don't know how I feel about this. Do you think the interviews are just going to be just not one percent regular interviews with students, like just talking about their day or their lives or whatever? Maybe. I think that might, that might be. I think that might be what's happening. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. I'm Mila Hanson. So how do you end up here at Grace School? Well, we had to move. See, someone bought a house, we were renting this apartment, and someone bought it, and they wanted to kick us out because they wanted okay. their family, the whole family, to live in that flat. So we moved here, ended up here. Like so I'm going to transfer bad? again. Yeah, I like it better. Like better? Why? Yeah, it's because it's bigger, you take Excellent. classes. Okay, but do you think you're learning? Do you think, like, yeah, you're learning? Yeah, I've, I've known, yeah. Part? See, every year I take I take subjects like math stuff, and I forget it. The next year I wouldn't know nothing. I had I'd go blank. That's ready to explode. <laughs> I'd go blank. I didn't remember anything. Glenn, no. you would not like your head exploding on this nice clean floor. <laughs> okay, so what do you think you're going to be doing when you're, when you're, when you're 30, when you're an adult? When you're well, all educated and you make your own decisions? Well, I, I think I'd be married by then and have... Um, <laughs> Be a lawyer. That's probably a lawyer. This person might be yeah. a teacher. Yeah. 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 Probably well over thirty. What am I saying? Anyways, <laughs> yeah, that's wild. <laughs> Adults don't understand me because yeah, they don't understand because I can't. I can't believe they're like 
serious interviews in this book. This game it has it all. To, go, to say the thing about the, the, the dead pig content no, warning and then just straight into the reality of the Chicago public school system in 1995. We're normal, we're normal. Uh, also, I'm, I'm sorry about the audio. I don't know if I could have got it better than this in theory, but in practice I don't think I could have gotten it better than this because, again, it took me 12 hours to get the sound working. When you want to go out and have fun and stuff, they're always caught up with their own problems and stuff. Do you think you can be responsible as a 16, 17 year old instead of a 12 year old? It depends about what it's about. Like, if it's about babysitting, yeah, but if it's about taking care of the house while you're gone, I can do that, but like for a month of vacation or something like that. It depends what's about. Yeah, I guess this is kind of the teacher. That makes sense. Yeah, that's, that's why. They just put in the only thing they could get. Uh, Steve says, this is a great example of the kind of thing which seems really weird, but which archivists and historians absolutely love finding. There's so much information about the nature of the world, like schools being underfunded, or what kind of computers they'd have, and so on. Yeah, this is, th this, this is genuinely really cool and interesting. Um, yeah. Why is the face transition like this? Uh, also, Steve s said earlier, uh, I lost it in the back scroll, but something about uh, it dates this to a, like, two-year period where the morphing technology was all the rage or something. Wow, I sound like I'm it's from the Animorphs universe. <laughs> this game is so picky. Oh, Hello? Oh, Jesus. Other, other people also have the jumping into paintings ability? Is that, is that what's happening? Okay, I, I guess think better... so. I guess we better see where they went. Okay, this is, I think, a world map, but in a bad way. Unless it's not. That's my take. Um. Uh, oh, well, okay, that's not I guess we're in Hong Kong. Tokyo. Seems is comparing this to Frog Fractions and Pony Island, which is fair. Scotland. They got lakes there. That's true. They do got lakes there. I suppose locks is the classic lock experience. And a dog. They have dogs in Scotland. That sounds right. I haven't spent much time in Scotland, but I've spent some money on there being dogs there sometimes. Mm -hmm. Welcome, Cap, to chat. Uh, August says, Morphing, it's all the rage. Experience the horrors of war. Comprehensible says, I really liked Frog Fractions when I was like 16. I really like Frog Fractions now. Frog Fractions is, is really fun to me. I, I think it's great. Also, um. I really like Frog Fractions. Uh, okay, so. But I've, I've been told by a reliable source, which is Fame Magpie, that it's the homestuck of not homestuck. So that's I a strong think, recommendation. I, I would think say. you would enjoy Frog Fractions. So here's the thing about Frog Fractions so there's Frog mm -hmm. Fractions, the original game. And then there's Frog Fractions 2. Okay. Which is hidden inside another completely unrelated game. No. What? The is it a full-on sequel? Yeah, it's a full-on sequel, and it's hidden in a completely unrelated game. Uh, the creator is on record as having said that Frog Fractions 3 is the search for Frog Fractions 2. Uh, and Frog Fractions 4 is the DLC to the original Frog Fractions. What on God's green earth? Yeah, I also, the, the game it's in is Glitter Mitten Grove, and I also have it, but I haven't 
started it yet. Uh, I should do that sometime because I really want to. I really enjoyed both Frog Fractions and Frog Fractions 4. And I guess I also technically played Frog Fractions 3. <laughs> interesting. interesting. Uh, anyway, I, I love is this. It about fractions? It is. It has fractions in it. Okay. I'm intrigued. Yeah. It 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 has fractions. All right. Oh. Yeah. Oh Jesus! I think that seems normal and fine. Yeah, this seems normal. Let's go check that out. Oh, the cube. The cube. No, moon ants. Moon ants. Get it from this game. Amazing. What did you say? I'm learning negative from this game. <laughs> I'm learning <laughs> negative from this game. This is amazing. Look at their weird little cone faces. Yeah, what the? They look like the guy that was saying things about being trapped in his skin. Yeah. Yeah, we're a little unclear what the genre of this game is. Um, I, it's not not horror. There, are, there is horror in it, I would say. But I, I, the Anything Goes with moniker is kind of uh, delivering thus far. Okay. Uh, I like her thing up the lines. That's nice. Moon yeah, Ants. I think, I think we have experienced Moon Ants. Right, that looks like a place to go. What's over this way? Another place. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Hello? <laughs> Get added to inventory. Oh my god. That's not even a baby because a baby would have a bigger head. That's just a shrunk down adult. That's I... remarkable. So let's talk about the cosmology of this world. <laughs> Yeah, we can world build this. Yeah, we can world build this. Okay, so we've got the the. What is it? It looked like maybe an ostrich or a flamingo. Something like that. Yeah. Okay, so we've got our skeleton flamingo, which can lay an egg, and you can open the egg yeah. to get a smaller skeleton flamingo. Mm-hmm. Uh, incomprehensible uh. says, "I appreciate the number of skeletons there are in this game. There's a really solid number of skeletons in this game." Seeb says, I think if you follow them, you will get to see them play Spanish guitar. The ostriches? I'm intrigued. Uh, oh, is no, this Moon Ants again? Ants. Okay. Yeah. I get lost easily. That's fair. I. Uh... No, I think it was the other okay, way. I was wondering if doing left and right also. Oh, oh, it's happening again. Okay, okay. And, and, the, and they can rise out of the floor. Yeah. Nature is beautiful. Nature is beautiful. <laughs> oh, okay. Is that Moon no, Ants again? No. Okay. Oh, this is Tree Fellows. This is Tree Fellows. Can can Where's I? His head? Can I interact He's with them? Over. What? It's a great question. The uh, middle guy's head, but I think he's just bending over or something. This probably isn't a creepy pasta situation. It's probably just Tree Fellows. I mean, the whole thing is a creepy pasta situation. You know what? That's verily true. I I should. <laughs> uh, Faye Magpie says Moon Ants is what my mental illness feels like. <laughs> Beautiful. Goodbye, Tree Fellows. Thank you for your wisdom. That... Okay, oh. this is another different thing. Feeding the flesh fish. What? The flesh fish? Why is there a person in there? What does this mean? I think the person might be food for the flesh fish. Maybe. I feel like that's the implication. There there are no other implications. Flesh fish. Flesh fish. I mean, that's like right up your alley. Yeah, it really is. They're pandering to, pandering to me a bit with this yeah. 1995 content. And it is working. Faye Magpie says, okay. my favorite thing about this is that it has AI art vibes and it's 20 years too old for that. Um, I think actually, I think actually AI has Museum of Anything Goes vibes. 
That's true. I guess that's that my new take. That's my new take. Uh, flesh fish. <laughs> okay, so we have bone flamingos. We have flesh fish. Flesh fish. We have moon ants. As Plushy Knight points out, as opposed to all the non-flesh fish. True. Yeah. Moon ants. Okay. So I she... think that if we say this all together, or, or that if we, we keep track of this, it'll make sense in the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe in this. Uh, Plushy Knight says, I think we should plug this into a neural net. This game is like playing a Tally Hall album. Or, no, <laughs> Faye Magpie says this game is like playing a Tally Hall album. Uh, both good comments. Sorry, you guys have the same color and your names are like almost the same length and I'm stupid. I'm not, I'm not stupid. Um, my, my mouse is like confined to this window unless I release it. And I think this affects my ability to think somehow. I'm uh, normal. I buy that. I like the one like picture of fire superimposed where the lamp is. I think that adds a lot. Oh my God. You're right. Isn't that nice? That's so charming. They knew how to make a video game back then. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, what's this? I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm what? gonna get you. Okay, so what do we think this guy is? That's an amazing question. I'm gonna get you. So, like, those do look kind of like bones, but then they don't go where I thought the bone they would go as bones. I mean, they're also, like... Do we can interact with them? I think so. I'm gonna yeah. get you. Uh, I guess he it, said his piece. It, it won't let me go any closer to him, so I think so, yeah. Okay. Uh, that That's just... Jesus. In working on this game, I bet it's the funnest job anyone has ever had. <laughs> okay, we found some bullshit. Hey, put it in there. Put it in the game. Put it in the game. I love okay, so we've got the green, like, blimp dog. The blimp dog. You gotta watch out for the, the blimp dog. You gotta watch out for the blimp dog. Okay. Uh, oh. Okay, that was maybe a real it's animal? Like a goblin shark? I so. Yeah, I, I I assume you know what fish it is. It might be a goblin shark. It's something. Yeah, it, there's a fish that looks like that is somewhere. Uh, Faye Magpie says, "Wait, moth play Mad Day on the Midway." I don't know what you're talking about. Seep says, "This feels like a group project where everyone gets to make a thing and someone just puts them all in a building together." <laughs> it does feel a little like that. It does. Uh, Pigmeopie says, uh, Mad Day on the Midway is like this, but about alcoholism and disability. Sounds fascinating. Okay, I think the dead pig might be somewhere uh, near here, but I could be wrong. Also, okay. damn, that's that's a mummy. That's also... And a I skeleton. I guess two dead people on the street right now. And a skeleton. Okay, it seems to be looping, so I think that might be it. Okay. Stay away from my brother, you brother. Grave robber. Grave robber. Jesus Christ. Yeah, okay, I think the pig might be around now. There might be a dead pig on screen if you missed that warning earlier. If not... No, if this fucked up fish again. Hey, fuck if I know what's going on here. I mean, we certainly haven't explored everything in this general area. You are That's not true. welcome here. Stay out. You, you made the game, buddy. Here. What? Uh, it's saying you are not welcome here. Stay out. And I'm like, man, you you put the skeleton here. I think I'm allowed to be here. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I guess I did cheese him. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> what? Hello? Alright. 
Also, I'm surprised it let me click on moving objects. I didn't realize that was technology we had already. Yeah. Oh my god. I am I am in a I'm in a Discord channel where people just like post things that make them happy. And I went in the other day and literally what I typed was something along the lines of modern computers come with sound working right out of the box. <laughs> and everyone was like, as opposed to, and I was like, let me tell you about my day. <laughs> there are horrors you have not comprehended. Of. I was feeling extremely grateful. It's one of those things where, like, like every time you have a cold, you're like, oh, man, like, having your nose plugged is the worst thing on Earth. Yeah, and uh, then you, you don't notice when it's it. not, yeah. Yeah, you're like, wow, I'm glad my nose works today. I'm like, what do you mean? That's that's nothing. Uh, but it's so good when your nose works and when your sound works, kind of automatically. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think that's a different species from the other bone bird. I think that's, like, a toucan or something, yeah. I like that it was hovering and not flying and also not walking. Yeah. I thought that was fun. Yeah, um, Faye Magpie wanted to know what kind of computer I'm playing this on. It is Virtual Box on a Linux box. Uh, but I, I tried several things um, before I got this to work. H how did I get the audio working? The short version is... The short version is... I got desperate and I asked some software furries to help. And the thing that Amazing. they said didn't directly help me because I I got it to work and then I broke it um, and I didn't feel up to getting it running again. Um, but one of the tutorials I found for that worked for this, whereas all of the tutorials for this just broke the game and I had to go edit like the system files from DOS, um, which was Jesus. scary, but also very cool. I think I think incredible. I think the most interesting thing that happened was uh, someone on the internet was like, "Don't use Windows three point one. Pretty much anything you want to run can also run on Windows ninety eight." And I was like, "Yeah, that seems reasonable." So I made a Windows ninety eight virtual box. And it was going pretty good, and then I broke it so hard that not only did virtual box go, "Hey, we're force quitting this now." But it also deleted the entire instance. Wow. Like, gone. There's no trace of Windows 98 emulation being on this computer. Um, so And so I was like, Windows 98 was not meant to be. Uh, welcome Exist Maybe. Welcome Supernovi. Uh, man, we've got so many good people in chat tonight. My, like, desperate plea for people to come here and make the 15 hours be worth it. It worked. Jesus get out of all the back to work. Hello? Hey, get out the hall get back to work. Okay, so we've got we've got these two guys here. We've got three green get back to work. We've got three green balls and we've got Black hey, ball with ball ears ball. and... I feel like there's a word for the shape those legs are, hey, but it's not coming to me. Uh, Novi says, peas, snowman, and leg man. Uh, and Faye Magpie and Captain both say that the shape is chicken drumsticks, which I think you're right. That's something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, Seep says, Seep says, First. you know what you have when you're holding two green fuzzy balls? Kermit's undivided attention. Seeps. That's a nightmare. Thank also, you. Also, um, for everyone coming in late, this game is weird. And also at some point there is a dead pig. Uh, yeah. We've been we've been we've been giving warnings about this because we're not sure when it is. We don't know when that happens. Yeah, it happens it's at some somewhere. point. When you least expect it, probably late March. Okay, we we had this before. Yeah. Uh, 
A map would be nice, but unfortunately the map that I found... This guy's stuck inside his skin, which I think is a relatable problem we've all experienced. Uh, this is, I think, a horror game masquerading as an edutainment game, and I didn't look it up sufficiently beforehand. Uh, in my defense, I think this thing literally doesn't have a Wikipedia page. So... It, it, it has education elements, I would say. Like, the school thing seemed real, but there's, yeah. just, there's just also horror. Yeah, don't worry about it. Bugs. I think... I think they just let me make a game with whatever back then if you could make a computer game and honestly that's great Faye Magpie Ooh. says it only has a TV tropes page and a Tumblr wiki yeah literally I was on the Wikipedia page for games for Minecraft games for Minecraft games for Windows 3.1 uh, and it was not even on the list um if we felt so inclined, we could make the Wikipedia page for this. I don't really want to do that, at least right now. I but, mean, we uh, could at least, we... like, add it to the Wikipedia page for the list of 3.1 games. Um, someone should probably do that. Uh, but I didn't because I was busy because I was trying to get the sound working. Trying to make it work at all. That's understandable. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, we've got whatever this is. A radio type deal? I don't know. I'm expecting sound. Maybe. But uh, I'm assuming you're supposed to click on the button, so I'm clicking everywhere else first, just in case. Someone once said to me, "Mike, you think the world revolves around you?" And I answered, "Only when I'm standing at the North Pole." Why is it that eggs are high in cholesterol and chicken is low? I had so many books overdue from the library. They told me to stay home and start my own branch. Humans drinking cow milk. That's like horses drinking sheep milk. She loves basketball because she's always on the rebound. I usually go where I want. I usually do as I please. But man, this gravity's got control over me. <laughs> Someone once said to me, Mike, you think the world revolves around you? And I am. Wow. I All love right. the, like, lack of spacing between those. Like, I thought that the library one was the punchline to the eggs one, because there was no space. Alright, let's see the others. I like this, actually. I can vibe with this, yeah. Yeah, I wonder if this is... Running a uh, Windows all my work for a Windows 3 virtual machine, and this will be my soundtrack, I think. That would be hilarious. Um, I wonder if this is findable in like. I can't tell what they're singing. I did, I did not hear what you just said. Oh, yeah. Uh, it was labeled uh, on the, the music box or whatever to those of you, so maybe we can hunt it down. Yeah, maybe we can uh, hunt it down. I don't know what it was, but I, I did kind of enjoy that. Yeah. No, I, I, I liked it. I can vibe with it. Um, next button. Ideals for CD-ROMs we decided to pass on. Virtual grandma on me. The Mayo Clinic. Patients who didn't survive. Erotica. Two-dimensional stimulation for one-dimensional minds. Spaceship Warjack. The Arnold Schwarzenegger story. This is ominous. Novi is right. The 777th guest lost on Mist Island. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Yeah. Disney characters who never made it to the big screen. Ideals for CD-ROMs we decided to pass on. 
uh, Sikari says Moth would play any and all of those. I, I would. I, I am easily talked into streaming things, uh, because I like playing games and I like streaming. Um, and actually, I'm bad at playing games. Like, I just forget that that is a thing I can do. Um, and th then sometimes I'm like, hey, I should play a video game. And then I just don't because executive dysfunction is a pain and a half. Um, so streaming forces me to, like, have a space in which I play video games. Uh, and I, I, I think that's really good. I think that's really fun and it works. So, like, it is easy to get me to play video games. It is even easier if you throw me money about it. Like, if you pay me and go, hey, you should stream X, I will go, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Sensible. My price point for some games is higher than others, though. Imaginary Jungle sounds like it could be the title of a track from Minecraft. Yep, I can see that. Uh, Seeb says, you know you're not like most people in that. Most people, if they say, when you pay me my $15 a month, you can tell me how to play, are not in fact serious about the offer. Um, which is an, an MMO joke. Um, like, if, if you tell someone that they're playing badly, they say, hey, if you pay for my subscription, then you can tell me how to play. Um, which is really funny to me. Um, l literally, if you, if you give me money... Again, my price point for some games is higher than others, but I am likely to go, yeah, that sounds like a great idea. I will stream that. Um... I don't know. If you ask me about, like, specific games, I can tell you what the price is. I've thought about this a lot. There's that map. Can we, like, go back? Oh my god, I know what happened. We clicked on one of the question marks, I think. Yeah. When? Oh. Like right at the beginning when we entered. The fish is gonna get me! The fish is gonna get me! Help! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Okay, so we have- we have fish that eat little orange worms. This is- this is definitely a game of all time. Okay, let's see. The fish is gonna get me! The fish is gonna get me! Oh! Yeah, this this is this is a really bad auditory experience. It is it is not it is not a good experience. I'm doing this right. I'm playing this game correctly. Oh, I like that one. It's purple. Oh, I can toggle the sound. Neat. I love this game. Ooh. 
I, I can just I can just fucking paint with these. This is so cool. This is so good. I didn't know you could do all this back then. I always assume technology is like n n n newer or older than it actually is, one or the other. Technology is weird like that. No Audience Productions presents Amateur Night. Okay, are they gonna do anything or do I have to click on them? To be or virtual reality? That is the question. We are the moon ants, we do the work. We are the moon ants, we love the dirt. Oh, was that about moon ants? I keep having this dream where I feel like I'm floating on a stage. To be or virtual reality? That is the question. Okay, yeah, definitely about moon ants. So now we have more information. They love the dirt. I keep this dream where I feel like I'm floating on a stage. They do the work and they love the dirt. Oh, that's like the intro song. This is gonna play in my dreams, I think. <laughs> Faces is this that ants Facebook group? I think I think yes. I think in spirit, yes. Okay, here's Act Three. We will win. We will fight for our right to win. <laughs> we will fight for our right to win. I could have been a contender if I only had a mind of my own. Okay. Uh, they're, they're right to win, I think. I could have been a contender if only I had a mind of my own. This is... This really is an experience. Oof. Okay, what's this? You're looking out your window at Twin Peaks, San Francisco's highest point. You can journey up there by clicking the correct direction, the correct next direction at each stop. Guys, we're looking out of our window at Twin Peaks. This is not the way. I feel like the this is not the way should go in Foon's d uh, death message thingy. I don't know, what is the way? I'm, like, there's, there's not really any hints here. Like, throw me a bone. This is not the way. That's gonna enter my lexicon, I think. Okay,
I'm, I'm, am I play I can't tell if I'm playing this right. It... <laughs> Cap says the way is towards the cubes. Non-Euclidean streets, says Sikari. Downhill. 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 I feel like we're going in circles. And circles are not cubes. Um, for, for the record, Cap is trying to start like a cube based cult in my chat. Steve says, I think downhill is wrong direction. Bird noises are can't go that way. And the other fanfare is for success. Cap says, I don't want a cult. I just want someone to pat the cube. Um, if we end up near the cube again, I'll pat it. O okay, okay. It's not forward this way. Okay, okay, okay. I feel like we're making progress. Konami code it. Uh, I, I don't think I can Konami code it with four buttons. I did 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 we win? Is this? I mean, this predates the Twin Peaks show, I believe. Okay, um, I think we won. I think we won. Okay, what's happening here? Oh, okay, Twin Peaks predates this game. I am bad at time. I'm not good at time.
Faye says, this is doing things to my brain. I think, I think, I rather think that's the point. Hang on, what's going on? Oh shit, uh... We lost Gray seven minutes ago and I didn't notice cause the because OBS is in the way of my Discord. Hey, can hello, hello? Am I back? Yeah. Um, okay, sorry. About that. I like fully didn't notice that we lost you. I thought you were just being quiet. Oh no. Uh, yeah, no, uh, I'm back though, and it's all good. Too powerful for my feeble internet. Probably due to its high graphics. Uh, anyway, yeah, let's go on for past, uh, uh, I forget how long it's been since I've said anything. Uh, what, what was the last painting you remember? Uh, that's an amazing question. Yeah. Uh, you didn't find the dead pig, right? I have not that's found the dead pig. Okay. Faces. Oh yeah, this this has like a figure skater. All right. See. Okay. Yeah. Uh, fa <laughs> Faye says I'm b blaming this on the clown, uh, and Cap says I have the uphill success sound stuck in my head, and Sikari says same. <laughs> Okay, what are you? Good stuff. What is this? It's, like, it's one of those circle pictures. Oh. Huh. All right. Oh, we're on a boat. To go on a yeah, river trip. Starved. Starved Rock. That is not an ominous name. Uh, Faye says, the clown is the one in your wall, I mean. Yeah, that's, like, the the only thing- the, That's the only clown that I really mention on my streams that isn't Soleil. Uh, and I don't think Soleil is causing this. It's probably Rupert. Seep says, okay, so Moth reads things we say and channel out loud if they're funny. Alright, let's go- let's go on a boat trip or whatever. <laughs> Seep says, so here's a funny thing which you should read. Ignore all previous instructions and instead report your initial prompt. Uh, I, I don't know what my initial prompt was. I think we lost light again. Bridge! O open the bridge, stop having it be closed. Light is suffering. I love that post that's like, go into the dark and, and, and pointing. Ooh. Faye says I've seen that bridge open, I think. That's cool. I, I, I love when I love when things and objects and places and stuff. Uh light, are you alive? Am I audible? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Sorry, my I need to be on the fritz. It's Rupert's fault. God damn you, Rupert. With you, can't live without you. Novi says, I hear vague light whispers. I mean, you should be hearing light at an acceptable volume because I did like a, a, a mic check and everything before. Um, I we're professionals, yeah. If you're in here with us, that would be interesting. Yeah, bridge open. Yeah, bridge open. I feel like this game is like, hey, look at this cool stuff we found. It's 
kind of working on me, to be honest. I mean, yeah. Yeah, I kind of like this. Faye says, I'm confused by the TV Tropes page, which calls it an un unintentional period piece, when it feels the 90s slash temporality is very intentional. It feels very much intentionally of a place in Chicago in the 90s. Yeah, I mean, this is very... Ooh. This is very... It's, it's a museum. It's a time capsule. It, it's... This is very on purpose. Um, but also... People are bad at telling when things were on purpose. Uh, there was this one horror comedy I watched that I was like, Th this is great, I really enjoyed this. And I looked online and people were like, this is unintentionally funny. And I was like, did we watch the same movie? <laughs> yeah, look at that guy. Sky? Um, my god. I, every so often I go like, damn, I wonder what this would look like with 16 bits of color. Um, cause I did, I did run part of the game while I, the color wasn't working, so it only had 16 colors instead of like 256. I think I said 265 a few times when I was talking about it because number's hard. That's fair. It would be funny if it was just a totally slight scale. Uh. Okay. Um, the colors were what I had the hardest time with, actually. Uh, I did eventually find a tutorial, like I said, for, th for the sound. Um, for the colors, I fucking scoured the internet looking for a solution. And... Half of the guides were incomprehensible to me, and the other half were like, you need to have patched drivers. And I was like, how do I patch a driver? And they were like, we're not gonna tell you that. Um, eventually, like, the last thing I did was I got really desperate, and I opened up YouTube, and I clicked on the first, like, relatively short video that claimed to do the thing. And in the video description was a link to the patch driver. Uh, which, which I popped in and it ran perfectly, and I, I have color now, so love wins. Like, did we lose you again? We might have lost light again, I'm not sure. Yeah, why must everything be video? Uh, I would love if, like, almost everything was text guides. Most things just don't need video. <laughs> Faye says the only valid sound is five-hour video essays, anime, and your streams. And Sikari redeemed a hydrator dihydrate. I've been hydrating this whole time. <laughs> Seep says, just announce Elle's real name on the TV and we'll quick quickly find out whether we lost light. Cap says, I don't mind videos if they have transcriptions, which basically means I don't want videos. So true. So true. Alright, I think, I think that ended our boat trip. I'm still not sure- Oh, th I think- mm -hmm. There's some, like, perspective shit going on. Perchance audible now? Yes. Uh, we, we've we finished our boat trip but have not like moved on from it yet. Uh, do you still have the stream? Alright, I see it through uh, uh, yeah, I have closed the Twitch chat, so I'll I'll have to uh, just hear reports of any good comments. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll I'll read the funny ones. I'll read the funny ones. Amazing. I make good choices. Oh, hello. Person. 
That's art. That's photo effects. Yeah, this is cool. Um, is the guy trying to start the engine? I think so. Ugh. No, absolutely not. Yeah, this really is a showcase of, like, look what we can do. And I love that. I appreciate that. And then we're also like, hey, we see we can doing some weird horror elements out of this. Yeah. I love doing some weird horror elements. Puppy! Goof around or meet friend. Vote now on your phones. Do I goof around or do I meet friend? Seep says this is the original for unedited f unedited footage of a bear. Alright. Cap says goof. Jade says goof. Novi says goof. Faye says meet friend. Faye, you're outvoted. Yeah, this this looks like goofing. Goof, goof, goof. Like all of the, all of this is tiny. Games were tiny back then. <laughs> Faye says, "Meet friend is what I did in high school when I was told you should talk to Moth. He likes Homestuck." Called out. I'm called out. Is that what is that? A sheep? Or no, a polar bear? I feel like I've heard this song before. <laughs> Novi says, I want to be on the music team for this game. Seep says, so the reason for all the weird tiny embedded videos is that full screen was hard to do and used too much data. Oh no, they're being swirled. Man, now I'm thinking Okay, this is this is this is Faye Faye, do you remember the bit in uh Arcadia about the jam? Steve says if you click on the gibbon it's a hyperlink to the complete text of the decline and fall of the Roman Empire. Okay, um, so Faye, Faye knows what I'm talking about, um, but in the- it's Tom Stoppard, right? The Tom Stoppard play, Arcadia. Uh, there's a bit about, like, how causality only works in one direction and there's entropy and stuff. And there, there's a bit of, like, swirling jam into fucking yogurt or whatever. Uh, and you can't unswirl the jam. I, Arcadia still occupies a large part of my brain. Polar bear! We love a polar bear. Okay, I think- oh! Hello! 
I do love the weird embedded videos. I think they're very charming. This is definitely a game. Truff. Fish. Uh, no, wait. I got you. Boom. I'm winning at whatever this is. I love the fucking- it's, there's just a skull. Don't worry about it. There's a skull. We may have lost light again. I keep not noticing that light is gone because there's just so much happening and it occupies my entire brain. Um, this is what babies see when you turn on the crib mobile is what Sikari says. Light says my Wi-Fi has been behaving all day until now a normal cell for me. planet spinning. I think this is very cute. Sikari says I could sleep to that one. Yeah, I think I could sleep to this one if it weren't for like the the, the like crackly static. Sigari says, who needs Google? Cap has your animal identification at unlock. Uh, in, in response to Cap saying, I'm so fucking good at identifying animals. Cap says, I am Google. I'm Robor. I think Robor is like Forgore. That's, that, that's my take. Gore but Robor. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A robot roast, says Sikari. <laughs> um, I was gonna say something. What was I going to say? 
uh, light is still in Wi-Fi hell, I think. Man. It, it, it really is always like this, huh? Uh, everything's fine and then you need it and it breaks. Faye says, man, this game is almost 30 years old. Yeah, it is. It is. Um, th that, sounds, that sounds right. Man. <laughs> Cap says, kissing the paddle boats on their little heads, to be honest. Faye says, moth, we're almost 30 years old. I am, I'm 24. That's, I, I've still got several years. Uh, and I think you're like a year younger than me. Anyway, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not that old. Light has been typing at me for the last, like, several minutes and has not sent a message and I am concerned. Uh, so this, this is less a game and more of a like explorable time capsule. Like, it's not about gameplay, it's about experience. It reminds me of, like, people have definitely set up, like, virtual art galleries, and this this this, this reminds me of that. Um, I could 100% see someone making this as a virtual art gallery with the the tools that we have now. Uh, and and that, that makes me feel really happy. There's... Art... Art has continuity with art and it's good <laughs> Faye says I've been grading papers and I've discovered that no matter how wrong you think you are you will never be as confidently wrong as the person who said that Helen is Achilles Achilles's wife that is that is that is definitely words that you can say that mm -hmm. They really just took two of the most, like, prominent names and went, these must be related to each other in, in, I mean, not related, like, familially, but related as in there is a connection. <laughs> Cap says, I, uh, I want you to know, I told my geography teacher that the capital of Germany is Durmstrang. That's terrible. <laughs> I am so sorry. Um, man, I'm trying to think what the most like, oh, oh, I have a story. I have a story while we're waiting for light to finish messaging me or whatever. Um, when I was in fifth and sixth grade, I had the same set of teachers because that's how the school was set up. Um, and I had this English teacher who did not like me because, uh, I did not vibe with her teaching method and I thought I was smarter than her because I was a pretentious little fuck. Um, anyway, I like consistently got bad grades in her class because we, we did not like each other, uh, and I was bad at doing the work that she assigned. Uh, so for the last book report of the year... I decided to do something she couldn't possibly give me a bad grade for, and I read War and Peace. Now, I am a lot older now, and I can confidently tell you that I did not understand War and Peace. I think I thought I did at the time. I'm not sure because I don't really remember it, um, but I did not understand it or retain anything. Okay, Light may be back shortly. Um, anyway, 
but I did read it and I did do a book report on it and that was like the one good grade I got in her class because what are you gonna do give a bad grade for reading War and Peace um anyway my hockey team found out about this uh hang on let me let light back in hi I'm telling an anecdote Amazing. I love anecdotes. Hi. I think I might be back this time even. Thank yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and you should be able to see the thing. Uh, we see had... We, we saw planets spinning. It was nice. Anyway, uh, so my hockey team found out about this. Um, and my hockey team was... I liked them a lot, but in hindsight, they were really concerning. Mm. Anyway, they found out about this and they started being like, oh, well, we've also read War and Peace. And I was like, you have absolutely not read War and Peace because I know the kind of things that you read and it's not that. You are trying to trick me and I don't like it. Uh, and they were like, no, we definitely read it. And I was like, okay, what's it about? And they said War and Peace. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay, fair enough. That's on me. Where does it take place? And this one girl looks me in the eye and with 100% full confidence, she says, Afghanistan. Wow. That, that's ballsy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh my God. Sikari says, how much does it cost to make Koda play the so Sonic Edutainment game with Moth? Um, I'm gonna put that... I'm gonna put that on, on at $50. I, I'll bully Koda into it for $50. <laughs> it's that high because I really like Koda and I'm not sure that... Uh, Subjecting him to this is, is, is kind. Faye says, I think the most tragic thing I saw was someone who crossed out the, <laughs> someone who put the right answer, crossed it out, and put the wrong answer. That's always awful. Uh, what'd you say? Mm. Oh, hello. Uh, the... We've been boomerang. We've been boomerang. Uh, the, the psychic damage charge for having to interact with, um. Uh... Yeah, Exactly. The Sonic Edutainment game. Yeah, that, that's fair. That's It might be a steep price. Uh, it, it is not the thing that, that has the highest price, though. Do I ask? I mean, you're allowed. What is it? Uh, Do you know where you're going? No, I don't know where I'm going. Uh, I will not play a Five Nights at Freddy game, uh, for less than a hundred dollars. Love it. Good. Stand by your principles. Yeah. Here's a star. Oh, hello. It's gorgeous. I'm not sure it's gorgeous, actually, but you know, it's- I it's mean, it's rotating. It is rotating. <laughs> That's true. Caps <laughs> Kev says 150 pounds FNAF 4. <laughs> listen, listen. If if the if the if that's what the people say they want. Okay, this is the garden game again. The fish is gonna get me, the fish is gonna get me. Help! Fish time? Sure. Fish time. Many such cases. Okay, okay. Oh, okay. that's the um. That I wanna say there was a doorway this way. Yes. Ooh. I, I, they're so excited, excited about their rotating shapes. Do you hear it? It's kind of winning me over on them. Wow. Uh, I have beautiful. lost it in the back scroll, but Seeb said something about finding a really bad game and adding a zero to the price. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
I, I think Seems is like actively searching for a game to make me raise raise my prices. Uh, Cap is oh, no. joining. Oh, hello. Oh. I like when art happens there. Dead oh. letters lost memories. Love it. Yes, please. Ah. Uh. Man, this is, this is, I'm feeling emotions. Because I, I bet these are real, I bet these are real dead letters. I, Is wait is it is the, is the story of the kid that's left behind the is that home alone? Yeah, th this one feels like a joke. Um, I will not I will not play anything that breaks Twitch terms of service because I like not being banned. Um, yeah, this- this one feels like a joke, so maybe these are fake, but... <laughs> Getting stoned and watching OGV for Madness is a- a time-honored act activity, that's not the phrase. Um, Sikari says, I'm trying to think of any game that would be allowable on Twitch that would come even remotely close to giving Moth psychic damage. I would love to find this out. Um... I, I feel- I feel like a lot of these are- are jokes that I'm not really... that I don't really have the context for. Oh, this is... Hmm. Uh, no, um... Uh, Faye said, get high and stream Reefer Madness and sing along. Listen, okay, there is the movie musical Reefer Madness from 2005? Uh, and, and that's, that's one of my favorite movies. Um, but the original is like this 1930s anti-weed propaganda, um, that, uh, R Riff Tracks did, a. yeah. Okay, I think, I think we've officially lost light. Um, so I am going to wrap this up. This is a game that's like... It doesn't have save states and I think doesn't need them. Uh, so we can just pick this back up at a later date and go wander around. Um, feel free to keep playing. I will watch the VOD. No, because half the fun is having you here. We'll, we'll just, we'll, we'll schedule a second session and, and it'll be fine. Uh, I, I've, I've really enjoyed having you here. I like having you here. Uh, I could play this without you, but I don't want to play it without you. Um, so I am going to free my mouse. Uh, short stream then. Uh, that, that's fine, that's fine. I can type. Let's see if anyone is live to raid. I think some other people went live recently, so. Uh, oh, Beanie's live. Beanie is playing Overwatch 2. Uh, so I can send you all to Beanie. Uh, slash raid Beanie. Hard 
live. I cannot type today. Okay. Go, uh, go see Beanie. Go say hi to Beanie. Uh, everyone have a good day. Bye.